The Smokin' Flamingo Barbecue and Music Festival is coming up, and I have my friend Ken Lloyd to tell us all about it. That seems like the coolest name of any event it, ever. It, it, <laughs> it's an awesome event. We, we started this event uh, six years ago, of course, and the, the very first year that we did it, we were actually a, a segment or an entire segment on Barbecue Pit Wars on the Discovery Channel. Wow. They, they did a 30-minute segment on our contest, and it still airs to this day. My son texted me the other night, and he said, Dad, it's on at midnight, so we were, we were watching it again. That's amazing. So. It just shows you, of obviously, the success, but how fun it is. So you got great food, but it's also a music festival at the same time. Exactly. So you are bombarded by great entertainment. Oh, yeah, absolutely. It, it, it's uh, 58 competitors from all over the Southeast competing for the $15,500 in prize money for the barbecue portion of it. And then this year we've stepped it up a little bit with, by doing a battle of the bands. Instead of just having bands perform during the day, we're going to have a battle of the bands with some judges that are going to uh, pick the, the king of the barbecue band uh, for, for that event. And then there's also the People's Choice Award, right? Right, right? So you could pay a certain amount and then that allows you the ability just to kind of graze and judge food. <laughs> exactly. For, for this year, what we've done, um, the, the state cook-off side of it uh, that'll happen on Sunday, there'll be a people's choice for that, and every competitor competes in that. You buy a wristband for $10, you get to taste everybody's food, you get a little gold coin. Whoever's uh, steak that you like the best, you put the gold coin in their, in their voting box. For the first time ever, because people have asked for it year after year after year, we're doing it for the barbecue competition on Saturday. So it'll be, I think, there's, I think we're limiting it to 20 teams, but again, the first 100 people that buy the tasting tickets We'll have that opportunity to taste the, the barbecue and vote on their favorite. That is so, so cool. Now, it's not this weekend. It's the following it's weekend, the following right? weekend, yes. The and 16, then what are the times weekend. of it, then? It, it'll start uh, at 8 a.m. till 10 p.m. each day. That just sounds like, again, something fun to do. Now, let's talk about some of the music acts that are going to be there, because it is okay. a music festival. Well, our, our bands are still signing up for the, for the, uh, the event. We're going to release the names of the, of the bands that will be part of the competition uh, by the end of this week. I'll have all that's the final great. list. And yeah. then I believe your Facebook page, you stay pretty current with that, and that's yes. something that you wanted to make sure that everybody at home had access to. Yes. So what is the Facebook page? The Facebook page is Flamingo Lake RV Resort Approved Page. Is. And then another thing we have to address, coming in here, you just talk about how proud you are, because, again, you're going on the sixth year of this, right. and it keeps on growing, but you have some great sponsors. We, we want to make sure that you just said hello to them. Absolutely. We, we've got Dick Gore's RV World. We've got the Jacksonville Sharks. We've got SRM Concrete, uh, Northeast Florida Auto and RV, WQIK Radio, uh, Davis Tire, and the Jumbo Shrimp. Those are all of our platinum sponsors. And we also have Campers In is the official uh, People's Choice Contest sponsor. That's really, and what, what do families say then? Because obviously you're out and about, especially in the RV world. I mm -hmm. see you at all these conventions. Right. What's the takeaway? So like when they're there having fun, what are they telling you about they're, it? They're, they're, they're just, they appreciate the fact that we do this event locally, so they actually have an opportunity to come out and experience these events that they see on the television every once in a while. You know, they see them on the Discovery sure. Channel, the, the, these competitions. So they get to come out and see it. They get to see these guys prepare this stuff and, and, and go through the process of, of their turn-ins for steak and for brisket and for, for um, uh, ribs and, and pulled pork and chicken. And, and it, it's just, it, they, they have a lot of fun. There, there's just a lot going on. We're going to have a bunch of vendors. Um, so that there, there's a lot to do all day long. Well, it does. It just sounds like an epic party. And the yeah. website is flamingolake.com for more. And definitely check out that Facebook page because yes. that's going to stay up to date. And, you know, really, it's, it's, it's live. So as far as things changing, you will update that. And you're Absolutely. Ready to go. Well, Ken, thank you so much for all the information. We appreciate it. My pleasure. Thank all you right. for having me. Stick around. More to come right after this.